For months now, unincorporated areas in Jefferson County have had the ability to become a small city. The bill allowing this passed the Kentucky legislature in March. Now one big East End subdivision has started looking into what that would actually mean for them. WHS 11 night team's Bobby McSwine covered a meeting tonight about all of this. And Bobby, you found not everybody is on board here. Yeah, that's right. The new law is exactly the opposite of what the merger of Louisville and Jefferson County in the year 2000 was designed to do. Tonight, some Lake Forest residents are concerned that this move isn't necessary, and they say they want to learn more before giving their support. So it sounds like to me, being a city is expensive. What do I not have that I already have living in Lake Forest? I've been here for 10 years. I have everything I could possibly want. Homeowners in Lake Forest raising concerns during a meeting to discuss what becoming a small city could look like for the subdivision. House Bill 314, which passed in March, would allow it to happen if 66% of residents want it. It's a step up from 20 years ago when Jefferson County and Louisville merged. Politicians, including bill sponsor Representative Jason Nemus, speaking at the meeting. I'm a Louisvillian and, we, and, I, and I support merger. But merger hasn't lived up to all of its promises. Among other factors, Neiman says policing in the eastern and southern parts of the county is severely lacking and says these areas should have the right to make their own choices. Something Douglas Hills Mayor Bonnie Jung knows all about. Her city was formed decades ago and she says it's been uphill from there, using money on things residents say they want. They are things that we probably would never have been able to offer back to our citizens as a plus for a good thing in safety if it hadn't been because we were a city. Still, some Lake Forest residents say they want more clarity on if spending extra money to become a city would be worth it. I would say at this point we have a, a really good thing going here in Lake Forest and I would have to see, you know, again, see it all laid out. I'm going in with an open mind but it would have to be something that would create more value. Homeowner Jerry McGraw, who set up the meeting, says it's hopefully the first of many. Let us look at the various details and then consider them and make a decision with the information, not based upon emotional appeal at this point. And McGraw says he hopes to host monthly meetings about the topic. Residents tonight voice they want to hear more from people who oppose the bill and can speak to the cons of becoming a city. And a big story out of Lake Forest recently is a dispute about a concrete plant planned nearby. But becoming a city wouldn't give them power to stop it because it's not on Lake Forest property. I'm live in the studio. Bobby McSwine for the WHAS 1119 on your side.